Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Eric Oren. Good morning and happy Wednesday, everybody. Let's start with a look at conditions right now in Bend. Uh, wind out of the southwest and not too strong, around 3 miles an hour. It's going to pick up a little bit, but stay in the 5 to 10 mile an hour range. Fairly moderate today. Uh, and uh, we're looking at a temperature around 28 degrees currently. Uh, it's going to be a fairly cool day in the low 50s, but just a little bit warmer than yesterday, and we are fairly close to our seasonal averages. Now let's take a look at your workday forecast here in Bend. High is 51 degrees if you're headed into work. Uh, sunrise around 6.51 a.m. Uh, by 8 a.m. it should be just shy of 40 degrees. Uh, by lunchtime, we're looking at 47, and by the time you head home, just a little cooler than that. Uh, winds, as I mentioned to you, south out of the south, uh, and staying in the 5 to 10 mile an hour range throughout the day. Uh, sunset happening around 4.45 p.m. Now here is some weather headlines for you to keep in mind on this fine hump day. Uh, mostly clear and cold conditions here on the high desert. Uh, we're going to top out somewhere in the 50s as I mentioned to you, probably the lower 50s. Uh, it's the return of some sunshine in the forecast though today, which is very nice. Uh, and of course we do expect to see a little bit of snow, potentially some wintry mix in the higher elevations overnight Thursday going into Friday. But for the meantime, do expect a little break from some of that precipitation. Here's a look at the satellite and radar of the Pacific Northwest. You can see here uh, fairly light cloud cover and really no precipitation affecting us right now. And as I mentioned to you, we're going to stay dry through at least the early to middle part of tomorrow. Now here's a look at that future track. An area of high pressure is going to be moving in to keep the region nice and dry today. It's also going to be affecting our airflow. As I mentioned to you, wind's going to be out of the south today. Uh, and as this area of high pressure moves away from us, uh, it's going to bring a wintry mix overnight into Friday. But then behind that uh, wintry mix and some of that precipitation, you can see a drier trend coming our way to start the weekend. Uh, so do keep that in mind. Uh, we have a little bit of precipitation coming, but also some dry pattern uh, after that. Now, t uh, winds right now, pardon me, uh, out of the south and probably going to stay that way out of the south and southwest for most of the day. May pick up to closer to 5 to 10 miles an hour, but as of right now, fairly light and calm here, closer to around 5 miles an hour sustained winds. Gusts not going to get too much higher than that, as we do expect things to stay fairly stable today. Now, viewer photo of the day from Steve. Uh, thank you for this beautiful sunrise over Crescent Lake. As you can see, just a gorgeous color gradient here on some clear skies. We're going to see pretty uh, clear skies today, actually mostly clear through most of the day today, so we may see something similar here. Now, temperatures right now in the 20s and 30s across the area. And, uh, of course, we are, uh, as I mentioned to you, forecast to top out somewhere in the upper 40s to low 50s. Of course, Warm Springs just a little higher than that in the middle 50s, today at 55 degrees. Uh, our overnight lows, as I mentioned to you, you have another chilly night coming our way. We are in the teens and also the 20s. Uh, bend at 30 degrees being the warmest in the forecast area. Uh, let's take a quick look here at your seven-day forecast. Now, here's the thing. Smiley's having a tough time this week, so we better check on him. He's been grumpy all week. I'm certainly hoping that he cheers up a little bit by the time we reach the weekend. Uh, he's given a sarcastic thumbs up today. We do see a chance for a wintry mix uh, overnight Thursday going into Friday, and then things clearing up a little bit by the time we hit uh, Veterans Day. And this weekend, a slight chance for some rain going into early next week. And those overnight lows getting warmer as well. That's your local alert weather forecast. I'm Eric Horn.